All right, what's up, Malo Soviets? I'm here with the third episode of Black Buck. So, in the last episode, we ended off going into this journey. Vas Vasilisa, I think that's her name, Vasilisa. We ended up going into this journey to help at a windmill. Because this guy, he said that um, he started seeing like this large shadow or something at the windmill. And he wanted our help since we're a witch, we're a whatever the fuck they're called. They're not a chort. It, it was something like founder, or whatever, something like that. Finder. I don't know. But um, he wanted our help to get rid of this demon that was over there. So we went on this long journey. It, it's weird in this game to go to that specific thing to that you know to the windmill we had to do all these different like all these different you know tasks first we had to go to all these different areas to go to the windmill but it was actually pretty easy honestly i thought you know i thought it was going to be so long you know journey side quests i thought it was going to be all that but no it's just going over there maybe we find an item maybe we find a demon but other than that it was very simple. But when we go to the windmill, when we got there, we ended up coming across a demon named the 13th Brother. Which, in that video, I also said that sounds like Madara Uchiha or Pain. I don't know, it was, it was crazy. You know, that voice sounded way too familiar. But we ended up fighting off the 13th Brother and as you can see what Vasilisa says here, and then he disappeared. We were so close to beating him, so close to killing him. Then he just decided to run away, which was weird. But um, it was such a tough fight. I was so close to dying myself. But um, other than that, you know, this is taking place at the events after that. So without further ado, let's get right into it. Well, uh, while you were gone, I had some thoughts about the seals. Every single piece has its meaning, and every seal requires a demon. The second one is the Aspen one. We'll have to think what to do next. Seal Asp, other seals, seal the Asp. was opened by touch, and that was all. How do I open the second? I mean, question of the night or day? What time is it? It's 2.57. Well, not by simply touching the asp, that's for sure. That's bullshit. I think we need evil spirits. <clears throat> so like a demon? So do we have to find the aspen demons? What? Alright, so there's different demons. Well, I mean, there's obviously different demons. I mean, I watch Supernatural, but um. What the fuck, man? I don't know yet. I'll have to think on it. Think on it? Think about it. Did he say about it or on it? Go deal with it. Or in it. You can at the moment and let me think. Go deal with what? Okay, other seals. I doubt that, but who knows? Look around a bit and maybe you'll fortune upon the right chort. Uh, what was chort again? The Colden's familiar. That's what it is. A demon or devil who serves as a Colden's familiar. So can we get a demon to serve under us? Is that how it works? Wait, what'd he say? Hold on. I doubt that, but who knows? Look around a bit and maybe you'll fortune upon the right chart. Um, I guess? Go to work, then. I don't understand. Hello? The chorts are back. Chorts are back. I sent them to perform an arduous task. That's why they weren't around. Now I should give them tasks? 
I mean, yeah, you're a witch now, you know, seems fair. Well, what did you expect? Exactly. <laughs> I love Igor, man. Sassy ass motherfucker. Do what you signed up for. Yeah. Everything has a price. Especially wishes. <clears throat> <clears throat> yeah, me too. If you don't want them to torture you, send them to curse people. Is that fair? If you don't want them to torture you, send them to curse people. So, you know, just, you know, not to be tortured or not to be, you know, just... What's the right word? I believe the chort will just... Fuck with you until they give you... Until you give them a task? So just go curse random people? Like, I could curse the neighbor down the street? If that's... What? That's the life of a Kaldun for you. And sure. You to curse anyone. I mean... Um... Curse the 13th brother. Can you... Can, can she curse a demon? Then suffer. These demons won't leave you alone. Uh, I mean, what I said? Before in your bestead. Not often, though. Now you will see them plenty. Not often, because he always sends them out to curse people. You can observe our entire gubernia in your bestiary. In the end, you decide what you do with those jorts of yours. Subdivision of the Russian Empire. Sure. Ah, uh, pester with jorts. Odegor has passed on to you his pester full of chorts. You now have a number of chorts yearning for mischief. Be careful, idle chorts torment their golden masters. It takes some time for chorts to do their job, a day or more. Each location has a specific type of job, hunger, strife, corruption, etc. Each short has a job preference. You can discover it by learning a specific skill. Shorts perform better with their job of choice and worse with the ones they hate. In order for shorts not to torment you and steal your health, don't forget to give them jobs every morning. Okay. Um. Lost his eye in a bet with a sinful law who accepted bribes, now hates people even more. In Oprichnik, during the reign of Ivan the Terrible, Matt V is now a fiend. Bat Ivashka likes it when children starve. Okay, so send curse and torrential rains, get rid of... Shit, there's a lot. Place a curse on the crops. Okay. I gotta find shit. Hung animals, strife, and hunger. Hunger. I'll send you. Uh. Fire. Fire. Calamity. Calamity. Weather. Okay, fire. That would be... Or weather. Weather. Call a hailstorm. Any of you call a hailstorm? Bro, oh, I don't want to fuck up. Uh, not enough skill points, sure. Alright, let's just send you guys somewhere then. Three days? Damn! Alright, let me send you to Atlanta Hernia. Fuck it, I'll send you there. And then fire, get rid of the Sudoku. So that go spirits. So the curse. I guess I'll send you there. Hmm. 
I mean, that's it, right? Damn, all right. Ignore! I saw the Uyest in a completely different light. There is no such place where a demon wouldn't hide. You just noticed your own chords are also a giant pain. I can see that now, yeah. About old Egor, demons at the windmill, your own chorts. Nothing to it, really. Just give them something to do. The only thing is they can't manage every task well. I mean, that's bullshit. They're demons, aren't they? To wreak havoc. They don't like any other sort. Okay, sure. Let's just talk later. Visitor number four. Give me a boy. Aren't you the same one as last game? Last video? It's me again. Yeah, it is. Oh, thanks. The spirits have stopped haunting us. Well, they ran away, so um, I figured as much, you know. Here's what I promised. Yeah. <sighs> By the looks of it, the miller inherited this motor. It's far too old of a thing to not be enchanted. Herbs and healing Zagavors restore plus one. The spirits, however, took the money I saved from my grandson's books. That was I uh, wait, no, I stole that money. Oh, wait, wait, I stole that money. I stole that money, didn't I? I swear to god I did. Well, it is what it is. Well, <laughs> I mean, Alright. Black book. There's nothing really here, right? Antique what the fuck? I mean, sure. Visitor number three, come on. Visor, hi. Hi! She swelled up, just like you said. You were nowhere for sure. Here. A gift from our household. She swelled up just like you said. You're a knower. Knower. Yeah, that's what it is. Knower. I said founder, didn't I? Or finder. But is it this is the peasant that um was bitching about his neighbor, so we just cursed her. Well, see ya. Alright, visitor number two. Aye aye, Captain. Glory to mankind. My godmother sends a jug of milk and sends her regards. Now who the fuck are you? I don't remember talking to you last video. Kolya, is that you? Uh, Igor, get out of here. <laughs> Hello, Igor. So, you're back. Yeah. yeah it's been oh. almost a week. You sure have grown tall. How tall are you, exactly? Uh, Twelve uh, Vershoks? Vershoks? An archaic Russian unit of length equal to approximately 4.2 centimeters. The saying that a man is 12 Vershoks high means that his height is 2 Arshins and 12 Vershoks, which is about 2 meters. Well, what brings you here? Good to know. I heard about your man, Vasilisa. My man, yeah, he killed himself. Hard to lose loved ones, I know. He did he kill himself? I think I gotta watch the first episode again. Hmm. Yeah. However, I'm here for another reason. Oh! Uh, uh, sir, what you need, man? Yesterday evening at a get together, I made a bet with the lads. They dared me to enter Bania at night. Traditional Eastern Slavic bathhouse with a wood stove. I don't believe all this supernatural stuff you see. When you go to war, you see things you know. Well, we've seen a lot of shit, so, um... Yeah. You should start believing in the supernatural, man. This old Bania, the abandoned one by the river. Yeah. It was around midnight. I opened the door and saw a sort of blue light. And it was quiet. A blue light and it was quiet. You know, to 
to take a stone. They wouldn't call me chicken if I showed them proof later. Suddenly, a hairy paw grabbed my left hand. Here, look, left a mark. That devil didn't let me go. All of a sudden, some female voice said, Marry me. Oh. My hand was hot as fire, and then I just lost it, and it kept on asking. And she still held on to me, wouldn't let go, so I told her I would. Then... So you're getting married. Congrats, man. As fast as I could. Lights his pipe. Damn this demonic power. You yeah, yeah. Help me, would you? Nikolai visited the barn at midnight. And something grabbed him. What might that be? Hmm. Phoenix Rasalka French joke. Visited a banya. Traditional Eastern Slavic bathhouse with a wood stove. Oh, I gotta choose. It won't give me a hint. The Bunny is near the river. So that was a Rusalka. No, there's a separate master with its own banya. That's it. Or perhaps a mistress. That was a banyak. <laughs> A male spirit that inhabits a banya? Ah, I hate this game already. What did she look like? What else did you notice? I couldn't see anything. It was completely dark. The hand was black and hairy. Yeah, yeah. The stone from the stove. Well, I took it with me. To prove to them I wasn't yellow. Didn't tell about the demon, though. Dropped it off at home later. I told my godmother, and she sent me here right away. Ah, <clears throat> woman, your godmother. Yeah, yeah, Igor. I'll help you. I won't leave you to the wolves. Vasilisa, take a closer look at the demon. This bunyik may have an aspen seal on her. That's great, a bullshit. Tonight, both of you. Talk to the demon and find out why she wants to marry you. Uh, Banya. You, Kola, use this bell bomb <coughs> on your left eye oh, to my see bad. the demons. Use this bomb on your left eye to see the Don't demons. The stone, Kola. I'll wait for you outside. Didn't think I'd be seeking help from nowhere. I've always depended only on myself, my military service. Well, it's quite a story. Maybe later. Yeah, yeah. All right, pester with shorts, Odigor. The moment I became a Kaldun, I, there is no such place. You just noticed your own shorts are all. Why? Why do I need to talk to you? Right, let's go. Visitor number one. Hey, Vasya. They say you're a knower now. Yeah, yeah. What about it? This may be of interest to you, then. The other day, we were gathering berries by Kajil Lake. What is that? By the way, I have brought you some... Some money for what? Near Zapolsk. Anyway, we came across... What? Wait, what? ...holes everywhere. The horror... We came across this clearing with holes everywhere. So I thought you might want to go there. Who knows? Perhaps there are evil spirits. <sighs> okay, let's set off. Where do we gotta go? No presence or absence of blah, blah, blah. Okay. The forest grove by Izba. Okay. Let's go over here. Let's take a look over here. I mean, we have to go there anyways. You notice a black silhouette on the road. It appears to be shrouded in fog and is hard to distinguish in the soft lighting of the night. The air is filled with a strange song performed by the demon. You've never heard this melody before. A chill runs down your spine as you listen to the alien melody. Fuck it. The devil continues his song. 
You listen, holding your breath and not moving. Soon, the melody stops, crashes against the tops of the fir trees, and dissolves in moonlit silence. You feel that perhaps now you understand demon kind somewhat better. That's a hundred of what? Suddenly, a magic circle shimmers at the demon's feet. A moment later, another devil appears by his side. Oh shit! What the fuck? Okay. Can Nikolai, Nikolai, Nikolai also help me? Let's do, uh, you first. Give me more defenses, man. Oh, right, come on, demons. What the? Oh. Oh, okay. Do that. Do that. And that. Oh, there's three? What? Oh. Oh. Oh, I'm poisoned. Shit. Alright. Let's give you a one, two. Uh, deals to three. And then. Oh, fuck. Oh, I need to get this one. Alright. This should be good. Oh! Oh! Okay. Oh shit. Oh shit. My health. Okay. Uh, you're almost dead. So do that, do that, and then do that. Okay. All right. Got some defenses. Come on, man. Oh. Oh. Okay. Um, let me kill you with that. Do that. that oh, okay we should be okay from here on oh damn okay um oh wait which one's okay 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 I gotta like kill one of them like now. No. Oh. No. Oh fuck! I gotta like kill one of them. Not hard. Ah oh, damn! Fuck it. Oh shit, please don't kill me. Please don't kill me. Don't kill me. Oh. Oh shit. Oh, I'm poisoned now. Okay. Uh, fuck. I replenish. Ah, oh, let me kill you. Okay. Oh, okay. They're almost dead. They're almost dead. They're almost dead. Shit. Shit. They're almost dead. I'll kill you with that. I'll do this. And this. Okay. Oh, he's got one more HP. One more HP. Don't bring them back. Oh, fucking Christ, man. Okay, I need that, that, and, you know, just fuck it, right? Oh, shit, okay. Uh, let me get that right there. Bro, that was great, a bullshit. What the hell? Okay. What the fuck is that? All right, let's go. Can I, like, do anything with Nikolay here? Ball of snakes is rolling around the woodland road. 
scales glittering in the moonlight. The Spurs Snakes was Brushwood, Rita Snake defending Zagavor, walk around the snakes, help. You remember one of the Zagavars that Yegor taught you. You whisper the words and the snake ball falls apart. It seems as though one of the snakes is immune to sorcery and it slithers. Oh, fuck. Damn. Uh. You got this. Come on, Vasilisa. You suck. Fuck. 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 I got like nothing to fight with here. Why? Oh shit. Oh shit! I'm done. I'm d oh. Oh god! Please don't kill me! Please don't kill me! Oh shit! I got it. There we go. Can I use one more? Oh fuck it. Fuck! I'm taking a risk. Taking a risk. I want to try to kill you fast. Okay. Uh, removes negative status. Oh, that's perfect. I didn't even need to read the other one. All right, let's go over here. Wow, this is a long journey. Near the old gravestones, you see a demon. His eyes are focused on the sky. It seems that he is in deep thought. He merely sighs when he notices you. Greet the demon. Oh, it's you. I remember you falling into hell. Nice to meet you too, demon. What a talkative short. Yeah, yeah. Well, what's so special about that? Me, I flew out of hell and decided to stay for a while. I mean, yeah. Uh, yeah. Help me find an answer to a question, and I'll reward you, which. Oh, God. Sure. Sure. Ask away. I'm searching for an answer. What are the three kinds of dates? You go out on a date with your loved one. Well, that's one. What are the other two? What are the three dates? You have one with a loved one. And then second is... Ah, oh, sh... You... What are the three dates? Surname. Fruits. Village. Fuck. Village called God! Damn it! What? Nonsense. You don't know anything, do you? Well, since you're not an hour, I suppose I can kill you. No, you c What the fuck is that? I think I need to kill you first. I'm gonna get that on you. Oh, shit. Oh, damn. Oh, damn. Okay, do I have any? All right, let's replenish that. Let's get that in. Let's get that in. And that. Oh, oh. Good, good, good. Doing progress. Oh, shit. Okay, okay. Do I got a... I'll do that on you, and then I'll do that one on you. Perfect. Holy shit! What the hell? Oh. Oh, fuck. Alright, he's almost dead. He's almost dead. Come on, come on. Oh! There we go, dead. Okay, let's do that on you, then that on you, and then Baba Boy. Oh, fucking hell. I'll go with this one here.
All right, so um, I think can I save right here? Yeah. So I think I'm gonna wrap it up right here because um, this is a long journey. The video is already about thirty minutes. Shit. I don't want it to be too long. Like last episode was like 45, 50 maybe. And that's crazy just for a game I just started. So I'm going to wrap it off right here. So if you guys did enjoy this video, please leave a big thumbs up. Leave a comment down below if you guys did enjoy and subscribe if you're new. And this has been Kevin Aguirre here. Peace.